اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو ڈبلیو 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 ڈاٹ اسلامی کلاسز ڈاٹ کام اینڈ مائی نیم از حافظ بلال سو ان دس ٹوٹوریل وی آر گوئنگ ٹو لرن دا آرٹیکولیشن پوائنٹس آف عربک لیٹرس رائٹ آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو میک دس ٹوٹوریل for the people who cannot read Quran correctly and they don't know the exact pronunciation of Arabic letters all right I will try my best to teach the articulation points of the Arabic letters in the easy way by showing to you the images and the place uh, from which place the sound is coming out okay of each letter let's start definition of articulation articulation definition is written here it is the place of emitting the letter when pronouncing it that differentiates that specific letter from other letters okay that is mean this is the place from which place we deliver the sound of Arabic letters okay that place in Arabic we call makhraj okay the singular of articulation points in Arabic is called makhraj and makhraj is the place uh, from which place we deliver the Arabic letter sound and that place we call makhraj okay from one makhraj from one articulation point we can deliver two letter sound one letter sound three letter sound and which also we call Uh, maharij uh, the articulation means maharij maharij is the like mean uh, maharij is a plural and makhraj is a singular this is a different the scholars laid out five major areas all right there are five major areas of our uh, face or you can say our mouth that have within them the different articulation points okay in our mouth there are five places and that places are most important to know the sound of Arabic letters all right which are total of 17 that's mean there are 17 articulation points in that five major areas you have to know that five major areas first and then within that five major areas I will show 17 Maharaj I'm going to the next page to show you that five major areas what are the five major areas are the number one is al-jawf al-jawf is the place the empty space in the mouth which is the empty space in our mouth that we call al-jawf i will show in the image that empty space where it is the second is al-halaq the throat as you know the throat al-lisan the tongue these are areas I am telling to you from which uh, areas you you will understand there are 17 articulation points in these five major areas so don't be confused remember the fourth one is Ashaftan this is also one of that five major, major areas Ashaftan means the two lips and the fifth one is Al Khayshun the nose Let's move to the next page. The definition of five major areas. The first one, I'll show the empty space in the mouth. The, the empty space in the mouth and the throat has in it one articulation point. Okay, in the jaw, there is one articulation point for the three lengthened letters. Right? There are three letters we can pronounce from this one articulation point which is located in the al jawf place the second one is al halaq the throat it has three articulation points for six different letters which are pronounced from the deepest middle and closest part of the throat we have divided this halak i mean the throat we have divided into three categories the first we call top of the throat the second we call middle of the throat or the third we call bottom of the throat 
okay I mean there are three articulation which I already told the top of the thought middle of the thought and the bottom of the thought these are the three articulation points in the thought the next one is alisan the tongue it has 10 articulation points for 18 letters the next one is ashaftan the two lips they have two articulation points for four letters all right al khishun the nose from the whole of nose towards the inside of the mouth here there is one articulation point that of the runa the next here i am going to tell you that five major areas and as you can see the first one is al khishun and that is this place of the nose al khishun the nose okay uh, this place of nose we call al khishun and from this place the runa sound come out the second is al jawf this is the empty space of our mouth and that is the green color you can see the next one is al shaftan two lips okay from this two lips we also deliver uh, some letter al halaq the throat from the throat also we deliver six letters and the last one is al lisan uh, there are 10 articulation points from where we delivered 18 letter sound so keep in mind these five major areas in your mind pronouncing the letter sound okay once you remember these five major areas you can learn more easily the sound of arabic letters and the, how you can pronounce the correct sound of arabic letters check out our online courses here and you can contact with us for more information you can visit our website www.islamicclasses.com you can email us at info at islamicclasses.com or you can call us here you can skype us as well our skype id is islamicclasses.com thank you for watching this video jazakallah take care allah fez assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh